Hi this is part 2 of the Let's Make a Visual Novel series using Rain PY. In part 1 I had demonstrated how to get player input like the name and gender and get choices from the player. So today let's take it forward. And have multiple characters for the player to interact with. So I will demonstrate how to have multiple characters on screen at the same time and provide some image tricks too. Ok so first I will show the backgrounds and characters which I will use here. So there are two characters here. And both have five poses or expressions. So for the character sprites I would recommend having them at the same height of your desired resolution. Here in this case it is 1080 as my resolution is 1920 into 1080. So I'll quickly scroll through them. Then we will get to the scripting part. Ok now let's start programming our game logic. First declare your player name variable and leave default value as you. Define your characters using the character class so that you can reference them later then here use scene command to show the background village and use with dissolve it will show a dissolve transition so this transition can also be applied to character sprites let me add some dialogue now And let's try playing it to test. So you can see the dissolve transition works smoothly. You can explore more transitions in the Rain PY documentation here. I'll leave it up to you to explore the remaining transitions. For now I am sticking to the dissolve one. It's good to have one consistent transition throughout your game. Ok now we will introduce our second character. Here we can use two show statements and call the transition after the statements. This allows the transition to be applied to multiple show or scene statements simultaneously. And you can see here we have used the at keyword. This allows us to show characters at certain positions. So let's add a some dialogue statements. And don't forget to use the images with expressions. You can use the show command as usual. And let's play it to see how it works. So it works pretty good. Now last video we learned how to enter player details. Let's utilize what we learned last time here. I'll quickly put some dialogue and add the input logic and add some more statements utilizing what we learned today about transitions and character positions. Ok so now let's play and check if our script is working.
there you go. So it works and looks great. So I hope you learned how to program character transitions and positions in Rain PY. I urge you to check out the Rain PY documentation and experiment with the other transitions. So that's about it for today. Have a good day.